Hello, this is Ramblin' Rusty, part two of the old mission here in Ventura. The natives of the area were called the uh, Kamash. And here it talks about some of the daily life of the natives that were around here. This one mission that was set up here by Father Sierra was one that he did his best to treat the natives as human beings. This one tells a little bit about the different things that they produced. They had uh, cattle and sheep, of course. They had apples and pears, peaches, pomegranates, prickly pears, and grapes, otherwise. This is a beautiful section right here, and I will walk on around here. Over, coming around the corner, they will, has an olive press, and uh, where they would uh, press out olives, and they had a number of statues around here. And I really like the saying that they have here on the olive press. Only one life soon be passed. Only what's done for Christ will last. So true. And so I guess this olive press would be turned around and would grind olives. And I'm not sure where the oil comes out. Let's see if I look on the other side here. Now, I was not able to go into the uh, church part of it yet because they're having a funeral. They're just finishing that up. You, you hear the bells uh, tolling the songs. Let me go on around just a little more and uh, show some of the other uh, statues and the different candles and flowers. I mean, this is a beautiful, peaceful area right here. And uh, went on around. And um, of course it deteriorated over time after the uh, uh, priest uh, died and uh, next ones then were not quite as nice to the natives. Here is basically what the whole mission looked like because this, uh, the you can read here in 1912 and 13 anthropologists interviewed a native Kamush speaker born here. He, he drew up basically what it looked like then. But this is just a very peaceful place to come. And maybe when they get through the funeral, I will be able to go inside. So let me. This is part two of the San Bernardino mission.